safety first. Clear. Sofa. TV. All kind of garbage, huh? That's kind of gnarly. Very slimy. Are you locked up yet? Yeah. You have power to our new axles. Okay. Yeah, it rained quite a bit yesterday and the day before. This is the end of what's indicated on the map, but it keeps going. Now, yeah, you hear the, the opinion expressed often on the forums, right? Yeah. That um, the, the best axles are just the OEM ones, um, but what, they might just be parroting each other, right? So that, that may not be based on a lot of different people with first-hand experience. It might just be people repeating what they've heard other people say, right? That really might just be Bruce's opinion. It's been parroted 50 times. Yeah, I feel like. Uh the, 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 while that, I believe that, that's interesting, it's kind of overgrown, but... Yeah, this one is less overgrown down here. Um... Ooh, this little rut here. It sure is. Um... It's getting down near some stuff. While that may be, while that may be true, there are certain things, like Bruce obviously has experience with it, and I don't think that... I don't think that Torre 1976 would say something unless he had personal experience with it. Yeah, he doesn't really give a lot of opinions generally, so. No. High or low? I say let's go left, because this is all unexplored. Hmm, okay. Let's see where this goes. I'm gonna guess this one ends, but it could go down into the valley too. This one's disappearing quite quickly. Kind of is, huh? Yeah. Like there's a big, there's a tr tree down up there, huh? There is, yeah. Portion, I guess. It's a nice little valley they got there. It sure is. It's pretty over there. Yeah. Quite a hole. Oh. Stop next time we don't have a whole lot of traction. I'll get out and make sure we're something off. <laughs> yeah, I figured out the last time the easy way to kind of find until they were broken is by picking there's some deer. Man, up in there. <laughs> is by what? It's just by shaking. Once it was broken, it would just totally lose. You just grab it and like move it around the way more than the deer. Oh, <laughs> yeah, dude, it's hanging. Are you serious? Yeah, it's broken. What the f- What the f Well, the internet was right. Heavy duty? Not even close. Debating whether we fix it here, you, I'd prefer to probably get back to somewhere a little more official before we spend time taking the car apart. You want to get the zip tie or something to zip tie it up? That's what I was thinking, is maybe just zip tying it to the uh, lateral links just to hold it up out of the way. Yeah. Just go slow and listen for the sounds of things being whapped to death. I'm going to try just a gentle application of all wheel drive. Free wheel drive. Take it off again. Maybe. Nope, we need it again. All right, gentle application. Get a little momentum for this part. Don't turn that wheel. Turning the wheel, I don't think, is really what's going to cause us problems. What is it? Just any any load on those axles. They can't take shit, dude. Look, 
got the long travel. We need to carry momentum. We can do that. We always got the tire change and nothing else. Yeah. Definitely something I was lauding to the internet before this trip. Like, the tire chains will save us. The tire chains, yeah. We have it. We have them. I get it. <laughs> Enough of you guys have spoken up. <laughs> They're probably no good. Seriously pissed off, man. Yeah, I am. Why don't we just winch through this real quick? <laughs> Tire chains are going to be necessary. They might be. Try some gentle three-wheel drive here. We were able. To, we were barely able to keep traction on this going down. It remember? It was a struggle. Yeah. because it's hot. Yeah, that's not a bad point. That was just dry as it's gonna get, I guess is what I should say. It is, yeah. Let's see. Go right up there, just stay right in the middle of this thing. There's a spot people can get around us anyways. Yeah, that's really strange. My best guess. It's almost like the uh, hill, sunk, like the mountain sunk down. All right. situations like this that the uh, utility rack comes in handy. Yes, it does. You got a tire chalk? No, but I got some that'll work. I mean, there's an abundance of trash. There's an old dashboard right over here from dashboard. pickup or something. Yeah. Uh, center blocks. Everybody on the internet's gonna be so jealous of what? Uh, of your uh, your bolts that can actually be removed. Any 
Put your pants back on YouTube. For some reason it really helps a lot to give it a little twisty. Take a look at this bolt. You should get a look in there too at the remnants that are in the axle. I guess I gotta pop that part out too before I can do. Wow. So clean, so rust free. I kind of would like to break that other one just for a more definitive evidence and just a few, you, you know. This waste of a trip. All right, we're back in business. Kind of annoying that we have to open the door to use the high lift, but at least we can use it.